Hey everybody, David and David here from payitforward.com and upphone.com and in this video we're going to show you how to change the default music player on your iPhone. And why would you want to do this? One of the main reasons I want to do this and the reason I do, I actually haven't done it yet, is that Amazon Music HD and Tidal both have higher quality music than Apple Music, Spotify, etc. And by higher quality, you might think it's like crazy high quality, but it's not. We're talking about CD quality music here and higher, but I like to have music playing in at least CD quality. So this is a new feature in iOS 14.5. Beta just came out. We've got the beta. We're testing this feature out. Another reason you might want to do this is you prefer Spotify to Apple Music. You've got all your stuff in Spotify. Yeah, it's just so much better. Just more, you get more control over how you listen to music on your iPhone. So how do you do it, David? Let's get to the point. Jeez. All right. So the first thing you need to do is activate Siri. Okay. And then just say play a song or an album or an artist. Right. I haven't set this up yet, so play Pat Metheny. You'll see the options to make your default music player, and then you just choose the music app you want to listen to the song on. Right. And you might have to give Siri access to access the data on that app, but once that's done, it's done. Maybe. And what I just found out is that since this feature is still in beta, Amazon Music HD and Tidal, both great services, do not support it yet. So if you don't see this option the next time you play a song, it's because you don't have the beta of iOS 14.5 installed, but we wanted to get this video out there to let you know what you can look forward to. And I look forward to the integration with Amazon Music HD. Now you're not locked into a specific default music playing app once you choose it the first time. You can change it whenever you want, really. So you just grab your phone, activate Siri, change my default music player to Spotify. I'll need access to the data, I'll tap yes. There you go, Spotify is now the default music player. It's a little bit uh, finicky right now since we are in beta, but Hopefully Apple resolves those issues soon. I hope so. That's how to change the default music player on your iPhone. Unlike a premium music streaming service, subscribing to this channel is free. All you need to do is click the subscribe button. Thanks for watching this video. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed. Leave a comment down below. Let us know what your favorite music streaming service is. Thanks for watching.